everybody, thanks for joining us on today's video. Listen, this video is only going to be three hours long. Three hours, okay, because by the time I'm done showing you every little detail and the effort that went into this three-year build, right, you'd be like, oh my God, how come it's only 110 and why wasn't it $210,000? Well, the truth of the matter is it's probably closer to $150,000, but we have uh, a lot of documentation, receipts, and things like that, and I just wanted to make sure that we posted it at the right number, uh, but I think that once you see how much time, effort, and detail that went into this, you'll be like, i got to figure out how to get this. So I also want to point out, too, that this truck has never really been driven. It was completely done, right, completely done, a labor of love, and, uh, and he could no longer drive it by the time it was ready. So uh, we ended up getting him something else. His truck has about 100 test miles on it, 100 test miles on it, okay? And then... I would say that there's a couple small things you could do to it if you wanted to make a couple small changes, right? That could make it your own if you wanted to. You could leave it exactly like it is, or you could get, uh, we could, we're gonna walk around and we'll, I'll show you those things as well. Paint on this thing is ridiculous. I mean, ridiculously beautiful. The underneath of this truck is ridiculous. It comes with two full sets of hoods, right? It comes with this polished aluminum hood to give you that aircraft style look that matches kind of the interior of the car. And when you see some of the other things inside, like uh, some of the detail there, you're going to realize how fastidious this guy was when he was building this truck. I've spoken to him personally about it many times. And uh, let's take a few, t let's take, let's just get rolling. Let's just get rolling, stop talking about it and get it moving. All right, so this is Nardo Gray. This is an Audi color, right? Super hot color. Many cars, uh, modern exotics are being painted this color. And with the interior and the stripe and everything, it looks so good. Oh. Anyway, I like to... Uh, you know, photos can, can make any car look great. They just can. For instance, you've probably heard of Photoshop, right? Wedding people always make other people look good in there, but the video can't lie. The video says this is what you got, this is what's live, and here's what we got right now. We have crystal clear letters in there. Make sure you can read every letter. It's nice and crisp. You can see everything detail in this piece of paper. I laugh about it because people stop me all the time all over the country and say, and take a piece of paper and go like this. I do that because you know what, man? The truth is some cars are painted better than others, and this is definitely a truck that's painted better than most. All right, so let's spend a few minutes here just talking about some detail stuff that maybe is not in the ad or maybe you don't know about. So, for instance, like this Hemi engine here, this is a Fowler-built, fresh build, right? Fresh, brand-new build, expensive, right? You find a Hemi... Uh, and find somebody who can build it right, uh, they're automatically expensive. But not only do we have some great looks, right? We got some power too, but then there's detail stuff, right? For instance, like here, you got a polished air conditioning compressor. Why? Because this has cold air conditioning and modern heat. Like you can use this vehicle. You could drive to the beach in this vehicle. You could go to a car show. You could go out to dinner in this thing, right? Can you imagine pulling up in this truck in front of uh, the Palm or some restaurant like that? They're going to push the Porsche around the side. They're going to park this right up front and just stand there for a few minutes. Every person that walks out of the restaurant waiting for the valet to bring up their car is going to go, oh, my God, look at that. What is that thing? And this is exactly what I mean. People always say that's a great-looking car, but they don't really know why it's a great-looking car. Here's why it's a great-looking car. This polished air conditioning compressor here, these straps are custom-made for this hood. Look at the cool latches and the springs that are done to hold everything in place there. This comes with two hoods. It comes with a color matched hood, right? That's here and goes over the engine compartment sides. I want to put this on on so you could see that it was exposed. That way uh, it shows it really well. The, uh, the windshield here, for instance, this rolls out, right? It works just like it's supposed to. How cool is that, man, right? How many people you know have a roll out front windshield in their uh, street rod? Not many. And the fact that it functions and works the way it should, upgraded LED lighting in here, polished pieces there. The wheel and tire selection, that's one of the things I wanted to talk about. This looks great on this vehicle, but it doesn't have to stay. We can pick a wheel and tire that you want, okay? There's plenty of room. It's normal hubs that are on this car, nothing exotic. It has four-wheel disc brakes, so they'll look really cool, uh, especially if you had an open wheel, right, with uh, multiple spokes. You can see the calipers shining through, and we can make it a staggered stance, so we can always pick a wheel and tire set as well. The louveredness of this aluminum hood. This takes a lot to do this. Somebody has to do this. There's not a lot of people left in the world that punch louvers in hoods, right? 
So having this and having the original stock hood with the side covers, another side benefit of that. Anyway, I'm looking down the side. I don't know if you can see the exhaust system. If you look at the pictures underneath, the exhaust system is exotic. The exhaust system was a couple thousand dollars, right? Because of it's hand bent, hand made, hand polished. The tips are custom bent. The muffler system goes and routes itself like that, and it sounds great, all right? Forget all of the fact that it costs good and look good. It sounds just like a Hemi should, and it's nice. You can drive it, it makes a perfect tone going down the road while the AC is blowing in your hair and ACDC is blowing out the stereo. There's roughly $20,000 tied up in just this part of the, of the cab and chassis. Why? I'll show you why. This is all custom made, custom welded, custom done, custom hinges, custom this, custom that. Even little things that you may not have noticed, the satellite antenna for the stereo system is hidden right here. Right? It's not so big face in there. All new glass, gaskets, seals, right? And then we get into, uh, we get into some small things like Come on, man, really? Just one more thing, just one more thing. So the cool thing about this is the bed here, you can decide what you wanna do with the bed. This is a beautiful piece of wood, uh, not a piece of plywood, a beautiful piece of wood that's had this uh, decal put on it. The decal does not have to stay if you don't want it. The decal can come off, it can be just a wood bed, it can be something that you want, maybe you wanna put your company name in there, you could write it off as a company vehicle, take it to car shows if you wanted, something different, whatever. You could also do something under here, or we could just take that off and leave it, or we can just leave it. That's why I say there's some options on this truck here that we can do a couple things. All the hard work's been done, man. All the hard work's been done. All the big money's been spent. Whatever you spend on this truck now is going to be just minor compared to the investment that was put into it. I want to talk about how fastidious and how detail-oriented the owner was. He had this custom made so that if he takes it in for service, this stretches over the two seats, right? So when a technician gets in, he doesn't get the seats dirty, right? This comes with that. These are aircraft seats, custom made. The seats, the seats were $5,000 for this diamond stitching, uh, custom color matched here, cup holders welded in, these cool aircraft style seat belts, right? They're just cool. Every piece about this is cool. And he wanted to keep it old school looking, so he made it look like a four speed, right? Made it look like a four speed, but it's an automatic. And I'm 6'1", I got plenty of room in here, right? I got this too, you got tilt wheel, right? This steering wheel is from a boat. It's from a boat, custom made for this car with a polished steering column. Look at these gauges, man. The pictures uh, are spectacular. Angie's gonna give a nice panoramic view of these uh, dash and gauges all lit up and you need to see them because it's, it's the effort that has gone into this is amazing. This big speedometer right here, beautiful full gauges, right? All of, the, all of the things you need to know that's going on. I don't know, I get in here and I get excited and I get excited because we build cars and when you build cars, man, it's expensive to build cars. And when you can get a car like this, it's already done this beautiful white interior. The headliner is leather as well, matches, right? All this is leather. Everything's covered in leather, door panels, all this stuff. And this, my favorite, look at this. This truck is, I mean, this truck is so, uh, it, it's so old but so new and that's so great about it is like when you drive it it drives like a new truck because it has a full coil over suspension it has uh, four-wheel disc brakes it has big wheels and tires it has a big motor with a great exhaust so not only does it go it stops it handles it does all the things uh, a modern truck would do while looking like nothing like a modern truck so we close up this video we talked about some touches that you could do listen there's enough room inside these wheel wells to put 20 inch wheels and tires on here staggered 18s and 16s or 18s and 20s, whatever you want. Uh, the bed, we talked about that in there. Maybe you like it, maybe you don't. Easy, whatever. Comes with two hoods, Nardo gray, pepper white stripes from uh, today's modern mini. Big giant Hemi in here, right? Air conditioning, beautifully restored interior, dash, leather, headliner, all of those things that go on. Uh, and if, you, if you've ever restored a car, it is a monumental effort and expense. It's like a part-time job. Uh, on top of whatever you're doing. I'm telling you, man, this is the way to buy something already done, not even been driven, right? And that you can make a couple touches of your own. Anyway, call us 301-816-1000. We'll tell you all about this incredible, incredible Dodge Street Rod pickup. Uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe to our page if you would, please, and share this video with your friends. And lastly, if you don't mind, like it down there at the bottom. That would help a lot as well. See you next time. Incredible.